Dying is the easy part. I want to see what item he starts with. The problem is, is if he's like AD Bruiser in Italy, I can't start E and all in him because I won't win that trade. Even with my shield, I won't. That's why I like him mid better because the lane is shorter, so you can dash back easier. Um, and you can also charge in with your E and auto attack them because generally they don't. They start with like AP, so you can dodge their abilities. And you can just sit on him with your autos, which are actually long range, 175, because the sword is so big. For some reason, they made his sword gigantic. So you have a long range, or longer than other melees, and you just like dash through the minions, start hitting them, hitting them, hitting them, dash through them, hit them again, and then dash back through their ranged minion, be blind so they can't retaliate. Like he's really, really good level one against ranged mages, but uh, a top lane, you can't really do that. So. I really don't know what to do against him. We'll see what he starts. He's going AP nid. Oh, it's middle. Oh my god, I think I'm, I'm actually going to lose to Fizz. Fizz will actually do really well against me, I think. Never could stay in one place. We'll see. I feel like Fizz is really strong. Okay. Block with my shield. Follow the lead. I think Yasuo's kit's really good for aggressive players. I think if you play him defensively, it's kind of meh. Loves. I might consider getting a hex drinker this matchup because this is all in is really strong. Double brawlers for that massive crit boost, 32%. Hopefully we can get some more kills on him. Wind wall wouldn't have blocked the tower shots because uh, the only thing this is going to block is a Lisa and Q being XP. Oh, nice. But there's no way I can um, I can block anything in Fizz. I can block his ulti. I think. Just. I'm not sure. I've never seen it. I've never seen the interaction. So he's spamming Dorn's uh, rings. He's going for the all-in. Okay, so he has creep advantage. As long as I have my shield up, it'll be somewhat okay. As long as he only hits me once. It'll block one hit. But... Pushing. He doesn't care about hitting me right now. I think I hit him, I'm sure. Oh, I crit? Are you serious? I have my shield. Okay. I'm not gonna take too much damage. 
just have to keep moving. I will not forget who I am. <laughs> wow, I should've I should have stayed closer to it, I think. <laughs> Charge my queue up. He did one good dodge, but I still managed to catch him. See? That's why you can't, you can't face Samurai's fish, because he just makes you into sushi. Not who would have thought. Aw, oh, damn. Shut up. I think it's a good time to back now. Yasuo OP. Yasuo OP. So, I know a lot of people get baited into buying the Avarice Blade. After playing this guy for a while, I, I feel like you really don't want to do that. I feel like it's better to get the raw stats, so that's why I bought double crit glove, and then I go straight to zeal, and I get the avarice last. I feel like it's bait, because he needs the stats to, to fight. He's, he's a fighting champion. He, fight, he likes to fight a lot, like early on, before they get too strong. Because his shield is really good at absorbing base damages, but once they start buying items, it, it tends to fall off a bit. So you really want to abuse it early and be as strong as you can. You want double cloth. Damn, that's going to be pretty rough for me. Holy shit, I should have used the potion. Oh my god, okay. Wow, that was close. I should have used the potion earlier. have a static shiv right when I get back. That's gonna make me super strong against this guy. So no I used my uh, wind wall a bit late. I didn't expect him to fish me because I thought he was still level 5, but he just leveled up and used it. Well, I'm pretty sure he was trying to solo it, so they didn't even get it. I might be wrong though. Yeah, they just warded it, so it's still out. Dad is Zingy trying to make big plays. I can't even blame Magic's procs anymore. Oh my god, Shifter. Shifter's so deep. He's in between their towers, what the fuck? The sword's full of company for a long time. Damn, that was pretty deep. What? I messed up. I accidentally used my circle Q instead of waiting a bit longer for my step. Italy is incoming. Okay, let's piece it out. I need to get boots, but I really wanna. I wanna know magic mantle. Uh, merch shots wouldn't be too bad this game because they do have Soraka silence, which is really annoying. So I can build it into that. I don't need to get a hex trigger. I'm pretty sure I'll be okay. Because the magic resist does scale with your passive shield, so that should really help. And I'm gonna start building my Infinity Edge. Damn. This is just getting. He fell behind early when I killed him, and then he just keeps dying. That's the worst feeling. Uh, they, you, you're never gonna get ahead, and you know it once you get to that point. And then people can just come gank you, and there's nothing you can do about it. That's what happened. Gragas just came. I said I had my ult. And then Dragus just came and we just comboed it. He died. Have to wait because uh, he might have his ult. Oops. I'm 
levels up. There's no way he can fight me. Should have walled sooner. And in fact, Shifter grabbed the kill so I didn't get that. Oh, well, that's fine. I'm gonna get the crit cloak. This is really important. You wanna stack up Yasuo's crit really high. Um, since you rush the Shiv, I actually like getting the crit cloak first because it puts you at 70%. And that's a really high amount. You're gonna be critting most of your abilities, and it's gonna actually um, cause you to crit your static Shiv a lot as well, which is a lot of your burst. So uh, it's gonna have a lot of unexpected burst potential. Just have crit like this. Under normal circumstances, buying items like these, you'll feel really weak, but on Yasuo, it makes you feel really strong because uh, crit is just so essential to his kit, and it gives him such a high amount for such a low cost. Like, he's got 2500 plus 720, so that's uh, about 3200 gold for 70% crit, among other things. And then, like, 70% is so much crit. Some 80 carries don't even get that much late game. When you get that, at 12 minutes, I have that. But yeah, it's important to farm on this champion, so even though I'm getting kills, I still need to just keep my farm up. I'm doing a little bit poorly at that. Right now, I should have more farm. Up. Try to get the tower. It is roamed, so I'm going to push this thing down. It is roamed. Uh, I guess he got a kill. I think his two kills are on me, so I don't think he got a kill. He got an assist. Yeah, definitely his two kills on me. Mainly just me dying to the tower after diving him. I'm gonna go I with Shift here. He can combo his satchel to my ulti. Is it up? Oh wow, it is. That's great. We got the dragon and we killed him. <laughs> That's mine, buddy. Alright, I'm gonna stop this guy from taking my tower. Damn, he also is so fun. My opinion just like changed dramatically about him when I figured out how to play him more. And build him, even. Like, I used to rush Avarice Blade. I'm like, oh, it's a convenient, right? But. Honestly, like getting that crit really high is, is such a huge. It just like makes or breaks it really. I have a, and then of course being aggressive early. I learned that. That's basically with comfort. If you're comfortable with the champion, you're more comfortable being aggressive. So I just had to play him more. But like I said, his kit is really good for being aggressive, not so much for being passive. So you you want to be aggressive. You want to be pushing early. You want to be using his minions to dash into him and to and to retreat at the same time. And the only way you can use his minions to retreat is if you're in front of them, which means you're being aggressive. CDR on Q gets really low. If I get Zerker Greaves... Zerker Greaves plus... Uh, what the fuck? Yo, dash through. There we go. 
Zerker Greaves plus um, Static Shiv will max the cooldown on your Q. I don't need that. Oh, I guess he couldn't kill it. Gotcha, buddy. Coming. I'll die in Italy. Got my wall for you. Watch your back. Oh, I tried. I tried to block it. I tried. Sorry. It's not. I'm so close to eye edge. Oh, he's gonna take the bomb. Damn, I'm so weak right now compared to what I could be. But I'm so greedy to finish it at the, at the all at once that I'm just gonna do it. Even though I really should go back to base and buy. Uh oh. Ah, oh, he didn't hit his ulti. Or he didn't use it. I was gonna ulti off of his ulti, but he just used it. Ah, uh, so close. Do I need? I don't think selling adorns will get me enough. No, it won't. Close. I'll have to wait a bit. If I sell my Dorans, uh, I think I can get my Infinity Edge if I wait a few seconds. Yes, actually I can get it without waiting. All right. Nice. I will follow this path until the end. Look at this. Shiv IE at 18 minutes. It's like it's so easy to get his core items, even though they're so expensive. It just feels so easy on this champion. To farm them up, and then once you get them, you'll see. Like, you'll see the damage. 90% crit. This, like, this guy's just gonna explode, even with Zonia's. He's gonna explode. Look at this. Look at how fast I farm. It's unreal. One shot the creep wave. It's like, whatever, dude. Look at that. One shotting creeps everywhere. My E is maxed. Anything I can possibly get. Sorry, I have to turn my music back on. Uh, I'm not sure if that counted. back just a shield I just died I had a shield and I just died oh my god I'm so sad all right now that I have the attack speed cap I can oh not quite I should have it. No, I don't. I need a bit more attack speed. I think I need to level up a bit more. Get more attack speed. I think that'll get it lower. An enemy has been slain. 
but it's the the maximum CDR you can get it down to is 1.33. And uh, once you get it there, it's like really, really powerful because you can use it almost while moving. I'm sad. I guess the shield doesn't last long enough. I thought I just like randomly died with the shield up, but I guess it wore off like right as the last stick was coming in. Oh. That is unfortunate. Just gonna keep dueling. I should probably group actually, our team is not bad. I really like split pushing because you get really farmed and Yasuo needs farm. But after a certain point, like right now, I should probably group. I'm so fast with this crit, it's unreal. Oh god. Oh god, my stacks were off. I couldn't replenish them. Oh, that Gragas will fuck them up. Oh, I still got it though. Uh oh. Shifter. Uh oh. Shifter, no. Oh, you. Oh. Oh. Oh, oh, oh my god, the dunks. Plays. Oh god. Oh my god, the plays. Oh. Oh. No, he's a silent. Ezreal, you don't need shield. I like Gragas carry. Actually, I don't, I don't know. Ezreal, it's okay, we'll carry you. Don't worry. Oh, shit. I'm trying to set up a Baron. I don't think I can. Do they know I'm here? Look how fast he farms, though. Like, look at that. I just one shot. That's one shot the creeps. It's. Wow. This is insane, dude. Absolutely insan insanity. Absolute insanity. Right now. We're coming. My armor is so strong. Good thing we didn't give him red. Or farm. Actually, I don't know. Yeah, he's, uh. He's not, he's not where the team is. Uh oh. Save me! Oh, buddy! I will just murder Baron. Oh my god. My Q is max CDR now. Oh, I hit a trap. Justice. Yeah, I need to get one more item. One more item, please. Oh, 
Alright, this game is... Yeah. I'm about to start one-shotting people. Telling my team what I can chain my ult up. So if they hit someone in a good spot, I can just go. I think what the hell are you doing, buddy? Get a good ulti, get a good ulti, and I'm going in. That's all it takes. Oh, I got knocked out. Still got Vayne, though. Chase. So good, man. Also, so good. Hey, Pasuno. Hey, good team. Good damage, though. This damage is real. It's the real deal, man. I don't even have my BT stacked. What the heck? Shit's gross, man. One shot the creep wave. Oh god. Oh my god. I need the shield to go off. <laughs> Alright, I'm getting a last whisper. I'm so strong now. No! I needed my shield to proc, but towers don't proc your shield. Only uh, jungle monsters are champions. I, like, I built it up because when you max your win wall, your dash builds up your flow. And that's actually what makes you tanky. If you dash through a lot of things in a team fight, you'll build your shield up immediately after you use it. And you'll get like a double shield, and it shields for like almost 600 damage. So it's actually a lot. Oh my god. Ugh. Oh god, this guy. Gotta clean up my own shit. Who's okay? So good. Just so good. It's too good. I kept saying it was hard to use him, but as long as you have something to combo off of, and as long as you get your items, it's, again, the key thing here is you need items. Treat Yasuo like a, an assassin. He's not like a tank who's useful without items. You need items to be useful. You need items to be your combo. Look at that damage, though. What the fuck? I'm not even stacked up on BT. It's the crit, man. 90% crit chance. Yasuo is a hyper carry. That is like he's literally a hyper carry. He scales out of control once you get all these items. Like my last item can either be defensive or I can even just get a hydra and go like full carry. This <laughs> much bottom. Never could stay in one place. <laughs> one shot creep waves.
Oh, I think it is close sight. Yeah, with the W, whatever. Oh, shit. So, ult him, ult him, ult him out. Ult. Oh my god, I almost died. <laughs> Gragas, please. That's crazy, though. The synergy. Oh, the synergy is so good. Ziggs.